Hello everybody, happy Transfer Tuesday, the day of the week where we take a look at our finances to see if there's any money moves we can make towards a positive financial future. I don't really know how to start the video this week because I'm just in awe and every single one of these money moves I'm gonna share with you came from you guys. 100% from you guys. <laughs> like, I just, whew. but first an unemployment update. Okay, I was confused on the timeline of things before. I thought I was supposed to get my first unemployment benefit last week. No. <laughs> Supposedly this Friday I will get my first payment as long as everything checks out and everything goes okay. I got another phone call again just from another um, person in the unemployment office. I forget where I've already shared this but in a different video but uh, I had just apparently I clicked suspended in the like reasons why I'm suddenly unemployed because <laughs> furloughed was not an option and so the lady called and she was like you click suspended but that means for like disciplinary reasons and I said no it's I'm just furloughed due to lack of work but that wasn't an option and she was like yeah that's considered a layoff <laughs> so I was like okay it, but however it felt really good to gather all of my stormwater sampling equipment and return that the other day since on I think Thursday I got an email from my employer that just simply stated you have been asked to return all of your stormwater sampling equipment by February 9th please use the attached fed FedEx label so okay <laughs> honestly it felt very nice to get all of that stuff out of my entryway and my coat closet and just drop it to FedEx and say see you later but it was just like <laughs> I don't know it just added another layer of this feels more permanent than a furlough. So that kind of sucks, but Bye. also it's okay. I just don't want to go back there anyway because it just feels shitty. <laughs> but that being said, the job market is also horrifying as I'm seeing. I didn't realize it was so bad. I have not been paying attention because for the last 11 months, I just watched my work email inbox be flooded with new hire alerts so I just assumed everything was going fine but I guess that's corporate America for you right they have their business growth metrics that they need to meet so they just keep hiring knowing that there's not enough work for people who are already there making the situation worse to make it look good on one end, but really shitty on the other. So I know I'm not the only one that got furloughed. I do not know how many people in this country that, that this specific company furloughed, but I'm just trying to imagine even new hires after me. Like what? Can you imagine being hired into a situation where there's not enough work and they're thinking about letting people go, but they're hiring you to meet a business metric? Yeah, so needless to say, I didn't realize the job market was so tough out there, but I'm up to speed now. <laughs> I'm still trying my best. Uh, not a lot of people hiring for a marine biologist, but I'm trying my best. <laughs> now let's get into these transfers. Tone down the sun for a second. Okay, these transfers, I am so mind blown. <laughs> you guys are so amazing. I'm gonna start with the super thanks from last week. So last Wednesday, I got a super thanks from Carol in the amount of $9.99 and she said, stay strong. Thank you so much, Carol. And then the next day on February 1st, I got a $10 super thanks from Kimberly and she said, Rachel, it's gonna be okay. Better things are coming your way, you got this. Thank you so much, Kimberly, you are absolutely right. And then a few days later on the 4th, Carol sent me another super thanks for $19.99. Thank you so much, Carol. You're, you're so sweet. And now I'm going to move over to the Venmo transfers. And Carol, my goodness, you're so amazing. On the 30th of January, Carol sent me $200. She said, this is a gift for you. You gifted me $200 a few months ago in the midst of a major appliances all dying at the same time. In the midst of my major appliances all dying at the same time. I'm sorry I didn't know about the collecting unemployment benefits. I haven't been a W-2 earner in 35 years. Good for you, girl. Good for you. 
Thank you so much, Carol. I, you are such a blessing. All of you are. This is so incredibly mind blowing. The next day on the first, I got a $5 Venmo from, I think it's pronounced Gina and they said, buy some fruit. <laughs> I will. Thank you. Thank you so much. And then on the 2nd of February, Jennifer sent me $250 and said, hope this helps out your February budget. Thank you so much, Jennifer. I, of course, a million percent that helps my February budget. Wow. Thank you. And then on the 2nd, Christiana said, hi, Rachel, stranger from the internet who stumbled across your YouTube channel. I've been in your shoes and remember my sudden unemployment and the roller coaster of emotions that came with it as if it were yesterday. This too shall pass. Wishing you a great upcoming weekend. Whew. Christiana, thank you so much. She sent me a hundred dollars. Thank you. Oh my goodness. That was $555 through Venmo from the last week that you guys have gifted to me. That is just wild. Now I'm going to jump over to PayPal. Last Tuesday on the 30th, Bevelyn sent me $150. They said, hi, Rachel, I have been keeping up with your progress toward achieving financial independence, and I'm truly sorry to hear about your recent job loss. I understand this can be a difficult and emotional time, but I want you to know that you're not alone. Losing a job can be a setback, but can also be an opportunity for growth and new beginnings. Absolutely. Remember, this does not define you or your worth. You have valuable skills and experience that will be appreciated by another employer. Take this time to reevaluate your goals and aspirations and use this as a chance to pursue a career that truly makes you happy. You're inspiring a lot of us. Take care. <sighs> Gosh, thank you so much. Yes, you are absolutely right. It is perfect opportunity for a change. And then on that same day, Grace, thank you so much. She sent me $15 and said, sorry about your unemployment. Take this time to grow your channel and enjoy yourself. I'm trying. <laughs> thank you, Grace. And then also on the 30th, I got an anonymous gift and they said, I've been watching you since the beginning. Please hold on. Everything will be fine in the end. I know it. Thank you so much. They sent me $77.40 and I appreciate that. Wow. And on the first, I got a notification that Janelle had sent me $22.99 and she said, I would like to pay for your Netflix this month, sending a lot of positivity your way. Thank you so much, Janelle. I really appreciate that. I will absolutely put that towards my Netflix. And then yesterday on the fourth, I got a notification that Mark had sent me $25 and he said a little something to add to your grocery allowance. Thank you so much, Mark. I absolutely appreciate you and all of your support that you've given me over this last always <laughs> wow i'm so blown away that was 290 dollars and 39 cents from paypal from the last week which is a total of 885 dollars and 37 cents that you guys have gifted me out of the kindness of your heart for this turbulent situation and i just have no idea how to even express how grateful I am for you guys and I just wow I just truly truly hope or or can't wait for the day that I'm able to turn around and pay this forward for someone else who's maybe in a not so great chapter of their life and I I don't even know what to say other than like I will never forget the generosity of other people during times when it really sucks and I'm so so thankful for you guys I all of you your kind words and encouragement in the comments means so much more than you know so I appreciate you guys infinitely for watching I am trying my best to just keep plugging along with job applications and and trying not to get too down and out <laughs> it's a little touch and go there for a minute but overall I feel like the emotional part of this journey has stabilized for the minute and I feel I'm back to feeling excitement about making a big life pivot because it does feel like the perfect time. Everything in my body is yelling at me that it is the perfect time. So I'm definitely going to be talking more about that very soon just because I'm not saying I'm doing anything drastic right away, but I... I'm definitely going to be making some changes and 
it's gonna be very much a different path than the one I thought I have been on for the last few years. So I'm really excited about that and to share more thoughts and feelings on this. Um, and what that means for my finances and everything really. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for being here. Thank you for your continued, absolute, amazing support. I appreciate you guys infinitely. I will see you very soon. Bye.